Well, if you don't want to feel so rusty when you get out on the course this spring, you may consider spending some time at the Rock Pile. Yeah, Kevin Kwok is a local golf pro, PGA pro, and the owner of the new Rock Pile at Pebble Creek, located in LeClaire. Kevin, thanks for joining us. Thanks for having me. So yeah. this has already been a huge success for you, even in the month of February. Obviously, we've had some nice weather to go along with it, so that's probably helped as well. But when did you first get the idea to bring this to the Quad Cities, and when did you open up? Yeah, so blessed with all the good weather. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Just prior to COVID, um, okay. a friend of mine acquired the property out there and uh, talked about, you know, what he wanted to do and asked me if I wanted to be involved in it. And I said, most definitely with the, with the golf background that I had in the Quad Cities, it only made sense. Mm -hmm. So I stepped away from golf for a little bit and this was yeah. a perfect opportunity to, to get back in the game. So yeah, so about three and a half, four years now. Yeah, and you guys opened in October. So the outside range, there's two parts to the rock yeah. pile. You have the outside where you can purchase balls out of a machine okay. and hit off the synthetic turf outside. Um, that opened late July, okay. and then I opened up the inside October 27th. Mm -hmm. And that's what we're seeing right now. Yeah. Um, so it's powered by a technology called Top Tracer Range. Top Tracer Range. Okay, so how is this uh, super beneficial for golfers? It sounds cool. We're, we're kind of seeing some images of it right now. Yeah, so uh, the Top Tracer Range technology, it's, there's two ultra super sensitive high tech cameras uh, that work better than the human eye. Yeah. Um, they trace the ball, they track the ball as soon as it leaves the bay. Uh, wow. It picks up ball speed, trajectory, and then it follows the ball all the way out and uh, basically reverses itself backwards and produces a tracer which shows up on the screen. Very accurate. Same technology that's used by the PGA Tour as, wow. as anybody watches golf on TV. That's amazing. Golf like the pros. Yeah. yeah. So it, measures, it measures curve and carry distance. You can calibrate your clubs, learn how far you hit all of them. So, so. with that technology, we were talking uh, before the show that you can do this rain or shine, but when it's snowing, when you have falling snow, probably not the best because it can cover up the camera, right? Yeah, about 30 degrees is the threshold for the right. heaters inside. Um, and then if any snow is falling, the snow, the reflective of the snow kind of tricks the cameras. The rain, no problem, but mm -hmm. the snow, the reflectiveness of the snow affects it. And it's sense. more than just hitting the golf ball. You have uh, games and challenges that people can take part in as well. Makes it, makes it a little more challenging, I guess. Very much so, yeah. There's a lot of, there's player development side of it, but then there's also the gaming side of it. So yeah. they're, right now they have 21 golf courses, virtual golf courses you could play from tee to green um, all over the world. Uh, there's some closer to the pin games. There's a points game very similar to Top Golf, uh, approach challenge, um, and then as far as the uh, player development side, uh, there's a my practice mode where you can mm -hmm. calibrate all your clubs, carry distances. Mm -hmm. So yeah, very high tech. So this could be fun for some groups as well. Um, yeah. I think I was reading you guys can have up to four people per indoor bay. Four people per, per bay. Okay. Uh, right now I have five bays open downstairs. Um, I have done a couple of corporate team building events wow. where folks have rented the place out. A yeah. couple of birthday parties. That's um, fun. But, but you can probably get, you know, six, around 30 people comfortably in the lower space. And you don't have to be an expert. You know, me, I was telling you, I'm, I'm pretty good at putt-putt, but that's about it. But, yeah. I mean, this could be a learning experience for someone who, who might not be very good at golf. Yeah, you'd be amazed. There, we have be anywhere from beginners to professionals. Um, the upside is that they have a local PGA professional on site that's yeah. there to help. Yeah, talk a little bit so. more about your background in golf. So, moved here to the Quad Cities in 2000. Um, was hired on as the head golf professional at the Davenport Country Club. Oh, wow. Uh, we ended up building that new clubhouse, moved here when it was a hole in the ground. Wow. <laughs> Spent six years at Davenport Country Club and then was fortunate enough to go back to my homeland area, uh, northwest suburbs of Chicago, uh, to a private club there. Was there for two years. Uh, six months after we left, my wife said we never should have left the Quad Cities. <laughs> and fortunately, two years later, Crow Valley called and invited us to come back. That's exciting. So, yeah, can't leave the Quad Cities, right? Once, once you, <laughs> they always reel really you back in. <laughs> reel you yeah. back in. Yeah. And, and uh, you will be offering uh, private instruction, golf instruction this summer, uh, closer to around July. Actually, we're teaching now. You oh, are. yeah. So we're ready to go. Give us a call. That's exciting. Yeah. And you're located near several other local businesses, some new new businesses. Yeah, as well. right next door. So underneath our roof, we have three separate businesses. Yeah. Uh, there's Five Cities Brewery. Yes. Which is a manufacturing facility or production facility mm -hmm. for their beer. Yeah. And then we have a great restaurant right next door called Jerry's. Um, you know, folks from our 
property can go over to their property and order a drink and then bring it back over to our property. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, three different businesses. It works really well. Yeah. It's a really cool spot. Yeah. And uh, the five bays, the upper bays, those, so these are all going to remain open pretty much year round unless it's, you know, colder than 30 degrees. Uh, you guys are hoping to open that, hoping to open that second floor here pretty soon? Still have a little bit of construction to do. So I have safety netting to put out off sure. the front of the building. So. Everybody stays intact. <laughs> and if people um, want to come out, it, it's got to be, you have to call for reservations, right? We do have an, uh, we do allow walk-ins, but you're risky, you're risky walking in. Yeah. Sure. Reservation's the best way to do it's it. It's busy. So. I will say, I, like I told you before we started this segment, I was at Jerry's a couple of weeks ago, and all five of those indoor bays were busy yep. the entire time that I was there. So, a very popular spot. Yeah. The Rock Pile at Pebble Creek. It's located in LeClaire. We have the hours on your screen. And to reserve a space or to learn more, Head to their website, therockpileatpebblecreek.com. Uh, Kevin, congratulations on a successful uh, new venture. Thank we appreciate you. you coming in today. Yeah, thank you very much. Thanks for having me. Absolutely. Absolutely.